Hey gang, Coach D, Enduro Mountain Bike Training, here for your January workout. So we're going to take uh, what we did last time in December, and we're going to build on that like we always do. Uh, we're still going to use more of the, uh, the compound as uh, single leg movements, uh, make them a little more difficult. Um, we're going to throw some core at you, uh, a little bit of uh, ballistic work, and we're going to do that in the same format that we did in December with a five exercise superset. Okay, so uh, pay attention to the variables listed below and um, go ahead and try two to four sets of everything depending on, um, on your experience. All right, so here we go. Okay, workout time. Five uh, exercise superset. Romanian deadlift, single leg with a row. So grab your bar. Of course, if you don't have a bar, you can use your dumbbells, right? Remember when we do our Romanian deadlift, we're going butt back to about here. The bar will go backwards. Your arms will go backwards a little bit. You got a neutral spine from your lumbar spine to the top of your head. Think about going that way with the crown of your head. When we get down here, we're gonna row. Okay, and then we're gonna come back up. But we're gonna do a single leg. So here we go. So I'm gonna go here. I'm going to actually hinge forward. My leg, opposite leg, is going to counterbalance what my upper body is doing. I'm gonna row unrow, stand back up. We're going to stay on the same side. Okay. Back leg is straight. I'm working through that heel to push that direction. I am not overarching my back. Try to maintain everything nice and flat. One thing you can do is to turn so that you can see yourself in a mirror. So I would just watch. Do know that when you do turn your head, you will lose your balance probably. So just use it as a a balance technique and a good posture technique when you're looking okay and then of course after uh, eight to ten you switch It'd be difficult to do heavy on this so beware the other thing i want you to make make sure you don't do is this don't open okay stay square nothing changes in the hip from where i go two-legged okay so there is your single leg romanian deadlift with a row. Now we're gonna go right into a push-up jack, okay? Push-up jack. So good push-up position. Don't get saggy, don't get rounded. Stay strong, heads neutral. Push-up to a jack, to a jack. Push-up to a jack. Now, I did this one, chose this one because this tends to break down a lot when we're riding and getting tired. So we add a ballistic move to it. To challenge you to maintain that posture alignment. We don't want to break down here, get archy or, or over our, uh, rounded, or we call that kyphosis. This is kyphosis, okay? This is hyperlordosis. We want to make sure that when you're doing your push ups and you're doing your gym work, that you're able to maintain your spinal angles, just like we did with the single leg Romanian deadlift, okay? Then we go into a curtsy lunge. Sounds funny, but it's actually very challenging to load this hip as well as balance and coordination. So good posture again. We're gonna reach back, loading this glute. And actually it's a good alternating pattern. If you're gonna hold uh, any kind of extra weight, you can go bar, nice strong bar action. You can also do dumbbells because your dumbbells will not get in the way. You can also go dumbbells here as long as you have good posture. If you want to do dumbbells up here, don't get here. You should not feel like those dumbbells want to fall forward. They've got to stay here. You do that curtsy lunge, foot straight, load the hip. If you have hip issues, start easy, start limited range. As you get more, more uh, advanced, go longer and deeper out laterally, okay? That's really going to challenge those hips. Obviously we need those for stability, for driving, and for maintaining uh, from a muscular endurance perspective, when downhilling, crucial for having uh, strong booties, strong uh, glute action. All right, so from there we're going to a, a single arm, low cable row. So on this one, if you don't have a cable machine, 
I do highly suggest one working out of a gym. If not, you would hook a band up to somewhere on the bottom. Okay. We're going to go single leg again because we're busting these glutes. This time we're going to go opposite leg forward and we're going to row. So we're holding that same kind of row position that we did with the, uh, the RDL. Now we're more into an upright position though this time with this row, a little more challenging uh, as it relates to having to balance being pulled forward versus downward. We uh, wanna train both of those forces this time of year. So again, we're here kind of upright, still counterbalancing with that back leg, good pull, turning that chest, shoulder blades are moving away, then they're moving toward, again, really good posture, breathing. And then lastly, we're going Russian twist. So you take your, your ball, uh, take your dumbbell, start light if you're unfamiliar with this. Make sure I'm not gonna run over my, here. Okay, you gotta make sure your face is parallel to the ceiling, your hips are, in, are nice and high, your 90 degrees knees. And I'm gonna maintain this rectangle that I have um, by holding the side of uh, the dumbbell. From here, I'm gonna turn left, and I'm gonna turn right. So you can tell that I'm keeping my elbows straight, and that's forcing me to maintain the line of strength within the, the rectangle that I'm holding, okay? So think about turning your, your shoulder girdle, your upper body, keeping your lower body still. And what's gonna happen too, is you're gonna have to, every once in a while, step, okay? Because the ball is gonna move, all right? So that's your superset for January, two to four sets. And then I would say follow up with any of the below recommendations from a cardio perspective, either a, a long, long distance or even throwing in a couple of intervals, depending on how you feel. Um, that'll also help clear up some of the, uh, the, the last lactic acid and accumulated waste from blowing out those booties during this little superset. So any questions, info at enduromqbtraining.com. You guys take care. We'll see you in February. Be consistent. This is how you make for a better riding experience in the summer. So we'll talk to you guys soon. See ya.